Conan Exiles is an open world survival game in which you use the freeform building system to craft yourself a village or city which you then use as a base to fend yourself. In order to dominate your enemies, you're going to need to create a safe location, a place that you can store weapons, supplies, a place which you decorate and you invite your friends to to show off, a place where your clan can gather to discuss their war plans. Building is a very important aspect of the game because it is the main way to secure your goods. Conan Exiles has a really nice freeform building system. Basically, we've tried to create a building system which is as flexible as possible. Uh, that means that it allows you to, to build buildings almost anywhere. One of the cool features that we have is that you can build a house on a mountainside if you want. In order to craft higher tier items, players will need to create crafting stations. These are things like forges, armor making benches, woodworking benches, tanneries. We have a huge selection of uh, placeables and decoration. You have tables and shelves and barrels and candles. You can craft gongs and horns, which you then you can use to signal the approach of your enemies or to let your friends know to open the gate. You can kill some of the hardest creatures in the game, chop off their head and have that mounted on the wall of your living room. Some of those decorative pieces are also little toys. Like for example, you can place an archery target that you can shoot at and it will give you a score depending on how close to the bullseye your shot is. Thralls are another major component of crafting. When players start to get into the thrall system, they'll be able to go out into the world and capture artisan thralls. And once you place, for example, a Stygian smith at a Stygian forge, suddenly you have access to Stygian weapons because his knowledge becomes your knowledge. You can attack other players' structures. Depending on the tier of the structure you're attacking, some weapons are going to be ineffective. You can also craft explosives that you can use that affect all tiers of building. When you plan your base, you should also make sure you have enough space for an altar, and you need altars in order to unlock the religion path. The avatar is the ultimate expression of your religious fervor in the game. When facing enemies with ability to summon avatars, it pays off to think on your base layout carefully. When one of them steps on your city wall, it's going to crumble. They say home is where the heart is, but in Conan Exiles, home is where you keep the hearts of your enemies.